Hello, brave readers. Welcome to our reading circle. Today, we'll be learning all about the consonant letter T sound and toads. Remember, the letter T makes the T sound. Let's see what words we can find in the book that begins with the T sound. Together, let's read T is for toad, illustrated by Mark Pattenden. Read and adapted by Miss Coralie. T is for t t toad. Ribbit, ribbit. Toads are a type of frog. Let's take a look at the pictures of the toads on the left side of the book. We have the European green toad. The Asiatic toad, the American toad, the beaked toad, and the European common toad. Then on the right, we have pictures of different frogs, such as the common European frog, the tree frog, the poison dart frog, and the wood frog. T is for t. T, tough. Many toads have tough, bumpy skin. Frogs often have smooth skin. T is for t, t, tongue. Toads and frogs have long, sticky tongues for catching insects. T is for t, t, tiny. Toads lay tiny eggs in water. Many toads lay eggs in a chain, but frogs lay eggs in large clumps. T is for t, t, tadpole. Tadpoles hatch from the eggs. Most toads and frogs begin life as tadpoles that live in water. T is for t t tail, because tadpoles have long tails. T is for t. T, toadlet. As tadpoles grow, their tails shrink, and they become toadlets. They look like teeny adult toads. A toadlet's tail stump disappears as it becomes a full-grown adult. T is for transform. Because toads and frogs change so much as they grow, as adults they can live on land and in water. Notice how the sound of the letter T changes when it stands next to the letter R. Together, the letters T and R makes the tr sound, as in tr tr transform. T is for t t totally t t terrific, because toads and frogs have amazing lives, and they help us by gobbling up bugs that eat our plants. The end. Toads and frogs are both similar and different in many ways. Based on the book, how are frogs and toads alike? How are they different? Finally, our phonics question for today is: What other words can you think of that begins with the t sound? 
Let's take a moment to think about it. Pair up with someone close to you and share your thoughts. Thank you for hanging out with us today, and we'll catch you later at our next reading circle. Have a good one. Bye. Thank you.